Hey guys, we're here today in Valheim, taking a look at maybe the most important question in the game. Are the bees happy? So we're going to go through everything that I know about bees and their production to try and gain an understanding of how to operate a bee farm in the most efficient way. The first thing you need to do in order to locate bees and start getting honey is locate a beehive. These will be found out in the world, almost always in the meadows, and they will be connected to a ruined building. If you get close, the bees will attack you and poison you slightly. You can either use a bow or a javelin to shoot the nest down or break the building around it to drop it to the ground and get a queen bee, which is the material you need to build a beehive. The bees can be placed in the meadows, the black forest, and the plains. They will, however, not produce or operate at all in the mountains or the swamp biome. And provided they are in the correct biome and happy, they will produce one honey every 20 minutes. And they will produce this honey regardless if you're in the area or not. If you're outside the rendering distance doing something else in a different biome, when you return, it may say empty at first. It may take a minute to refresh and recheck how much honey the bees have produced, but it will in fact produce honey while you are away. Another interesting note with the bees is once the sun goes down, it will tell you that the bees are sleeping if you interact with the hive. This led me to believe that the bees would not produce any honey during the nighttime. However, I was incorrect on this. The bees will produce one honey every 20 minutes, even through the night. This actually got me looking up and researching actual bees just a little bit, and it is in fact accurate that they will produce honey 24 seven. And although bees will alternate sleeping and getting rest, the hive is always active regardless of the time of day. So now that we've covered all of that basic information in terms of production, we need to look at the bees being happy. When you interact with your hive, it says the bees are happy. It'll tell you at nighttime that they are sleeping or if they're in the wrong environment. But if you have your beehive too close to some items, it will tell you the bees need more open space and they will not produce anything no matter how long you wait if they are in this state. And I will be completely honest with you. I do have a little bit of information in terms of the bees needing more open space, but I cannot get an exact answer on how the game operates with this message. If you take a beehive and place a single wall right next to it, it will need more open space. However, the game is not always entirely consistent on this, and sometimes it won't even be a problem. You can even try to stack beehives on top of each other, and you can see here with the raging bees and the honey in them that almost all of these operate and work just fine. But a few of them will not, and I cannot get an idea on why this is the case. Nothing should be different with them, and they should be in roughly the same exact state. With the exception that if you can see it, the one on the right here is just slightly lower than the one on the left. And these ones on the back row could be just a bit lower than the rest of the beehives. I checked on this a little bit more and placed some beehives hanging near each other and you can see that these two right next to each other are happy and they're roughly even. But then this beehive right here has the beehive to its right slightly above it if you look at their roofs and it needs more open space. Same thing with this one here where there's a beehive above it and a beam above it and it needs more open space. Where the one above them all is happy because it doesn't have a beehive slightly above its roof. So it seems like the needing more open space is tied to the brim of its roof and it can't have anything sitting right above that brim or it's gonna cause issues with its space. And that is kind of on full display right here. You can see I jammed a ton of walls inside of this beehive and it is still happy because all of the walls are below the canopy of the beehive. So one thing I can tell you is if you place things just above the brim of the beehive, it will cause issues with their space, but it is not consistent. And I don't have an exact answer for you on why sometimes it's not working. You can see this hive here is operating just fine. Although there is a rock right next to it and above its canopy still works fine. You can see that all of these beehives are happy being on post here, even though some are above it. I think this is also due to the fact that they don't have a post above their roof. So you can stack them very close together and even put them up at different levels, but it is gonna take some user tinkering and kind of figuring out what works for you in most cases. I even set a beehive circling around this post, having one come out every two clicks and hooking the beehives to them. And you can see they're all even on their brim. They're spaced decently and all of these beehives operate and function without any problems. However, on the back end here, if I place another beehive, for whatever reason, it needs more open space. I've messed with this for a while. I've moved it out, moved it in, cannot get it to work. It's at the exact same spacing. They're at the exact same height but these two beehives on the back end 
will not operate. The only way I have been able to get them to operate is by adding a one meter beam on the back sides to extend them both out one more meter and they both become happy. And I don't exactly know what is causing these two not to work in this circle with the rest. So I know this isn't entirely helpful and it doesn't answer the questions, but I can't figure out an answer myself throughout all my testing. I don't understand what the game is fully looking at beyond having stuff above the beehives will cause them problems. That's even proven more right here as I buried this beehive and just showed the top of it through the dirt and the bees are still happy provided the top of the roof is not covered. If I throw a wood floor on this one, however, the bees are still happy for whatever reason because that little stick is poking out. They seem to think that that's plenty of room. Why this beehive right here buried in the ground will work and operate properly, but the final beehives in this circle in the open air will not just completely baffles me. So as you go through trying to figure out what's going on with your beehives, it's going to take some experimentation on your part. Every setup seems to be different just based on little changes in the terrain. You can bury a beehive under the ground. You can jam a whole bunch of wooden walls inside the beehive and it will still operate provided the roof canopy is not covered or too obstructed. You can have a beehive out in the open air with just two walls on the side and it will need more open space. And you can shove a beehive in the ground and cover it with wooden floors and they'll be happy. I just don't understand guys. I don't know or get what is going on with these beehives, what exactly to do with them. I can just tell you that covering the entire bottom half of the beehive doesn't seem to factor in at all and it is definitely something to do with their roofs. I have also tried and ran through tests of what was mentioned to me that the bees have these little doors on the front and I have covered those specifically with posts and blocked them up and that also seems to have no bearing on their happiness. Again, it doesn't seem to be anything to do with the base of the beehive, even if it's near the doors. It is something to do with their roof and things being near it, and I don't exactly have a handle on it or an answer for you. Even if I had some more concrete evidence on any of it, this beehive right here would still throw me off being buried under the ground with a floor above it. I can even stack a second floor above it and the beehive will still be happy. So when you're looking at doing a bee farm or building a giant hive or something, you are gonna have to experiment. Try and avoid putting stuff around the roof of each beehive. Try and get them on level ground maybe, but you can stack them incredibly tight patterns. You can bury them underground as long as they are roughly even and there's nothing major obstructing the roof. And if there is something major obstructing the roof, it might still work. If you shove it underground in the dirt, give it no sunlight, cover it with two floors, whatever you want. Sorry that I don't have more answers for you guys. Hopefully some of this information was helpful to you still. And it gives you at least some ideas on how you can operate your beehives efficiently and how to place them. Maybe you guys can get some answers as well and let me know in the comments some info that might help me narrow this down on what exactly the beehives are looking for and how exactly they operate. Sorry I couldn't be more help in this video. Thanks for watching anyways. I will see you next time.